digging through my stickers, I found these super cute snowflake stickers and I got a burst of inspiration to do my January spread in them. Now here's the deal, I normally don't do it this way. Usually I wait until I get my syllabus for nursing school. My syllabus goes in here before I decorate. But because of the inspiration, I really want to do this. And I think it's going to be really cute. So I thought, why not do a video? Why not go ahead and plan? It's not going to hurt anything. I can add my syllabus to it later. So that's what we're going to do in this video. And I really want to use these cute little snowflake stickers. Now these ones come out of the teacher sticker book. I am using the mini um, Boss Babe dashboard layout planner. So I've got this layout and we're just going to do the monthly. I also have the Squad um, Life sticker book and this winter one, and I've seen some cute ones in here that I think would match really well, as well as in the winter one. So we'll see what we come up with here. The first thing I want to do is cover up where it says January and the 2020 on this side, and I just use white out for that. You stick stickers over it, you usually can't see it that much. Now I also have this Dates and Holidays Memory Keeping Sticker Book and this one and I'm going to re-date the January 2020. And I did this because I want it to be over top of that snowflake sticker. So. And then for 2020, I'm going to use this 20 and this 20 because I don't have any twos or zeros. So this will work out great. So I don't start class until the 13th, so I figured that if I add some stickers up and through here, I kind of balance some things out and then I don't have to worry about necessarily filling in too many decorative stickers that messes with me being able to actually plan for the semester. So I think that'll work out great up there. We usually don't do anything on Saturdays anyways, so.
All right, so I think that's all I'm gonna put in there. I don't wanna go too much because this whole section here will be taken over by my school planner, so, um, or my school syllabus. So once I get that in there, that'll be, the rest of that'll fill up. And what I'll probably do after I put my syllabus in is I may come back in and use the rest of these snowflake stickers and maybe decorate the center or something. It just kind of depends on what my school schedule looks like and how much room it takes up. So I may add some more things for that. So if you guys wanna see um, how this completely ends up, make sure you're following me on Instagram. And then the only other thing that I'll need to do when I sit down to add my syllabus is to find stickers that match the snowflakes and the little house and stuff. And I actually think I already have some that will work out fantastically. So when I add my syllabus, I like using little stickers like this. Like those little pink ones will match. These kind of do. The darker blue match, and I really love that color. So I have dots. Oh yeah, that really matches that too. That looks super cute. Okay, so I do have stickers that will match. I normally don't use the flags, but I use these ones. So. Well, good, I already found stickers to match this spread. So like adding my syllabus, I'll use like one of these little stickers here and it'll say class or clinical or whatever. So good, that works out great. I'm glad that happened. So that's that's my January thing. Like I said, I may add a little bit to it once I get my syllabus added, but other than that, that is it. This is the quickest little plan with me I think I've done in a long time. <laughs> All right, so there you have it. Thanks guys for watching. I appreciate it so much and I'll see you in the next video.